Hi everyone, this is Mike with Rococo. In this tutorial, I'll be showing how to take animations that are recorded in Rococo Studio, import them into Unreal Engine, and retarget them onto your custom character. This new workflow is only available in Rococo Studio 1.17 or newer. There are two ways to import an animation skeleton into Unreal. The first is to import an animation skeleton that is attached to a character mesh. If the animation skeleton is not attached to a mesh, Unreal will not accept the import. The second way to import an animation skeleton is to assign the animation to a matching skeleton that is already in your project. To directly import from Rococo into Unreal, you will have to do both methods. First, get the skeleton and the character mesh into your project, and then you can batch import all of the animation and assign it to the Rococo skeleton in Unreal. From there, you can retarget the animation onto your own custom character. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is import Rococo's skeleton and character mesh into your Unreal project. I'm going to export any animation out of Rococo Studio. It could be from our sample project or from any other animation that you've already recorded. It doesn't matter because we're going to re-import our animation later on. I'll be working with FBX and the default Rococo Newton skeleton. Be sure to click the export mesh box in the export options. Let's jump over to Unreal. I'll be using our Rococo Theater project with Bruno, the Rococo Mime. This project is available to download for free on our blog at rococo.com. Let's import your exported FBX into Unreal. In your content browser, navigate to where you would like to put your character. Click Import and navigate to your exported FBX file. In the default FBX import options, the only additional option to check is under the Mesh Expanded options. Check Use T0 as ref pose, then click Import. Now that your Rococo skeleton and character mesh is in your project, you can import as many animations as you want. Let's go over those steps. When exporting your animations out of Rococo Studio, be sure to use the same skeleton rig as the one that is in your Unreal project. Now that your character mesh is in Unreal, you can unclick the Export Mesh option. For this example, I'm going to import two different animations. In my content browser, I'm going to click Import and select my files. In my default FBX import options, I'm going to assign this animation onto my Rococo skeleton and select Import All. Now that your animation is imported into your Unreal project, let's retarget or transfer the animation over to your custom character. Double click on the Rococo skeleton. Open the Retarget Manager tab. Under Setup Rig, select Rig, select Humanoid Rig. Fill in the corresponding target bones with the matching source bones. Click Apply Asset. Check to see if your custom character skeleton has gone through the same process. If not, do so. Now that both the Rococo skeleton and your custom character skeleton are set up as a humanoid rig, you can now retarget the animation from one rig to another. Select the animations you would like to retarget. Right click, Retarget Anima Asset, select Duplicate Anima Asset and Retarget, select your character skeleton, the path that you would like the file to go to, and click Retarget. There you have it folks, importing directly from Rococo Studio into the Unreal Engine. Thank you for taking the time to watch this tutorial. Please like this video and share this video. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Head to rococo.com for the help and community page, or email us at support at rococo.com. Thanks for watching, and keep mocapping.